Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily inspiration card. Email me at angelsouls444 at gmail.com if you'd like more information on live video readings or if you would like to get a standard reading with me, go to angelsouls444.com. All right, let's see what we have here. If you've seen this before, well, I guess, would you have seen this before July 12th? No, you wouldn't have. Okay, so the next live <laughs> that I have coming up is August 29th of 2022, 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Pacific, and we're gonna be talking about Archangel Uriel. If you wanna take it for that, check out the link below. Oh, all right, so we have Desiree. No conditions aren't favorable right now. Wait or look into other options and ask the angels to help, guide, and comfort you. This card is really talking about us going down the wrong path. We are in this very messy time where it's like our, can I say our brains kind of got cracked, like, like in the light is coming through a little bit and we're realizing, I don't know that we'll be intellectually understanding it right away, but somewhere in us, we know this just doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel right that I'm so controlled in my career. It doesn't feel right that I work this many hours and I don't, and I'm still struggling to pay my bills. It doesn't feel right that the government can do X, Y, and Z, but we have to sit back and be quiet or we could be severely punished. It doesn't feel right that when we go to the airport, we might be treated like a criminal, even though we're not. You know, that sort of thing, you know, that's, that's definitely saying, okay, I'm making decisions from this like controlled space, but people are waking up to that, okay? They're waking up to how we've been controlled. Now, again, this does not mean that you go out and you're like rah, 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 and like doing all that. You have all of your energetic powers, that sounds, that sounds a little sci-fi, but you have, <laughs> you have it within you to observe, don't deny, see what it is to be strong. This is a time, I, I hesitate to use the word warrior. I mean, if you're comfortable with that word, cool, but you know, light warriors or, you know, standing up and being strong. Passivity is not, I don't think it's it. I don't think it's it. I, I think we've done that. We've tried it. It don't work. Okay. <laughs> now, again, I'm not saying be aggressive, but be reasonable. Be reasonable. Standing up and saying, don't let this rattle you. Um, thanks for the genius advice. <laughs> I feel how I feel. Okay. <laughs> thanks. Thanks, but no thanks. Or if someone stands up and says, you know, don't engage. Toxic. It's just as toxic as like good vibes only, you know. Sorry if you have that stuff laying around your house, because I know these are popular <laughs> sayings and they go on bugs. Okay, like, listen, hey, yo, I'm not saying you gotta go through your cupboard and throw it out because it says that. If it makes you feel good to have a pillow that says good vibes only, and it reminds you to lift up your spirits, that's one thing. If you're doing it because it's like judgmental of people who actually feel human emotions, that's weird. <laughs> We're gonna leave it there before I get myself in trouble. I'm sending you so much love and take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>